And the floodlights are shining down on the players here in the Spanish capital of Madrid. We're at the Bernabeu. My name is Derek Ray, and with me is my commentary partner, Lee Dixon. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Real Madrid up against Inter. Yeah, it's very important that you're not playing catch-up in the group stages. Match day one, imperative you get off to a good start. Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Cabajal plays with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Luka Modric plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the lead striker today is Karim Benzema. Inter's lineup is as follows. Samir Handanovic begins between the posts. Stefan de Frey plays with Milan Striniar in central defence. Arturo Vidal starts alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Benzema. Casemiro. Well, as far as the hosts are concerned, we know they like to press high when they can and try to win possession back swiftly. Lee, do you think it'll be that approach today? Yes, Derek, I do. It's a brave way of playing. It's a physical way of playing as well. Brave because you're committing a lot of men high up the pitch. Physical because all the players have to buy into it. Real in a good position out wide. Casemiro. On to Carvajal. Casemiro. Effective looking pass. And Inter have it once again. Benzema. Vinicius Junior. Mendy has it. Options in the middle. Mendy. Well, no way through. Oh, terrific pass. Great opportunity. What an important piece of defending. So after that, a goal kick it'll be. Ramos. Karim Benzema. Now Casemiro. Rodrigo. Benzema. Can he do it? And there it is, the breakthrough, that will do nicely. Well, here's the replay, it's a very neat piece of deception to get past the defender. And how strong was he here? Incredible to hold up the defenders and get his shot away. Lovely goal.
1-0 then. Alessandro Bastoni. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? Benzema. Tony Kroos. Now Casemiro. Carvajal. Well, not great defending. Casemiro. Well, still an issue here. You never really know, Lee, if it's going to come off when you hit it on the volley in that fashion. Yeah, hero to zero. When he struck that, you think, wow, and then all of a sudden you realise where it's gone. A move of promise on the flank. And a chance to whip it in here. And this is Brozovic. Martinez. Defensive efficiency personified. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. Promising pass. Playing with purpose and control. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Over it comes. Well, it still could be dangerous. Isco. Isco. Mendy. And now Rodrigo. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Oh, he's given the ball away. Karim Benzema. Vinicius Jr. And we will have just one additional minute. Martinez. Perisic with the ball. And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. Rodrigo, Benzema, and there it is, the breakthrough, that will do nicely. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Brozovic. Barella has it. Lukaku. Now Brozovic. could level it and it is the equaliser parity now and who's to say what's going to happen next well let's see that again once he gets into his stride he just strolls past players what a lovely solo wonderful effort this is Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, we all saw that equaliser coming, Derek, didn't we? And so did he. Substitution for Real Madrid.
So a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Modric. Well, Real Madrid possession stats are brilliant, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow. Chances on. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Able to get his body in the way. Modric to take the lead. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. Well, here's the replay. It's a very neat piece of deception to get past the defender. And then through on goal, you never really had any doubt it's going to slot that way. Good finish. A concession of a goal by Inter. And now the onus is on them to get forward. Brozovic Romelu Lukaku now and Real come away with it but they could run onto it here and they could do damage could be still could be dangerous well the pass got in the way and a goal the quick one too and they've turned this game on its head Well, Derek, as we see it again, it's a big mistake. You try to teach youngsters not to get caught in possession and be aware of what's around you. He has no clue, and he pays the price. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Mendy. This might have potential. Options in the middle. Well, the crossing needs to be a bit better than that. Vidal. And that's an important intervention. He's passed it forward to Aidan Azar. That's not a bad ball. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Now oh, you can see he was feeling the pressure, but gave it a go anyway. Not close, though. Well, it was definitely worth the chance. Just got the technique a little bit off. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Inter have given away possession. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Well, with your opponents bearing down on you, no wonder you want to just get rid of the ball. Now, what on earth happened there? Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And the counter-attack came to nothing. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Lukaku. Well read to put an end to that attack. Azar, Really inventive stuff from Real here. Gives it a go. Oh, my goodness. He's caught that so well. A goal of the highest class. Fantastic technique. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging for someone to get on the end of it. And the timing to get this spot on, yes, it needs a bit of luck, but boy, does it need skill as well. It's a brilliant goal.
Well, they've been poor all day, Derek, and your sense there's going to be a rollicking in that dressing room after the game. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Martinez. And they need to get tighter here. And foul it is then. Well, that could be his final rebuke, I think. And the referee's making that absolutely clear. So I like that, Derek. Good refereeing. Nice and strong. Told the player exactly what he was thinking. Well, we could have made that decision from up here on the gantry. We have entered the final minutes of normal time. Well, that's a super ball over the top. And mistimed the run, sadly. That's offside. And that brings the action to its conclusion. You've got to say, Lee, a horrible night at the office. That's the last thing you need. Start of the qualifying stages. You don't need a zero point, Sally. You almost need memory loss now to forget about that. Down to five games to qualify. Well, he kept asking questions, Martin Odegaard. Lee, what did you make of what you saw from him? Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him. an important piece of defending Rodrigo Benzema and there it is the breakthrough that will do nicely this could level it And it is the equaliser, parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? Modric to take the lead. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. Could be, still could be dangerous. Well, the post got in the way. And they've turned this game on its head. That's not a bad ball. Oh, you can see he was feeling the pressure, but gave it a go anyway. Not close, though. Hazard. Really inventive stuff from Real here. A goal of the highest.